Hello everybody, my name is Odinson and this is Modded Minecraft Dial 20 1.19 pack. Um, this is episode 8. And today I've got a whole bunch of stuff that I wanted to get done over the next couple of episodes. So I've um, got a, book, a list of stuff that I need to get done over here. So firstly, I'm just going to um, give you an update on what I've done between episodes. Um, I planted a bunch of food along with the industrial hemp we put down for a string the other day and I'm gonna have to sleep in a minute um wheat potatoes carrots just the basic stuff now those wandering traders that we've seen around I got annoyed with uh, one and killed it and its llamas got a couple of leads built some fences got a couple of sheep back here um and fenced them in for now it's partly why I started growing wheat because I wanted to breed them I'm going to need a whole bunch of wool uh, coming up shortly. So um, I'm going to start that process as we go on. Uh, let's see if we can sleep through the night yet. Do that quickly first. So I don't have to deal with monster sounds. Okay, down to the basement. All right, so we're down here. So one thing I did do is, is I switched sides on this reactor. So all the redstone stuff is now on this side. This is all working perfectly now, which is good. Um, and yeah, the control and the access port is now on this side. All good. I also cleaned up this. Um, I can actually put this. I don't need you here anymore. Or you. Just keep that around the back for the redstone for now until I find a better, cleaner way of doing it. All right, so the power goes out behind this wall and then we've got power running behind these and I've got my machines much more easily accessible. There's the uh, poke oven that we did last episode or the episode before, I can't remember now. Anyway, the first thing on the list that I wanted to do today was these things, feral flare lanterns, and I'll explain why shortly. But um, let's see if we've got any gold ingots already cooked up. I'm sure we have, just not many. Oh no, we must have used them all. Okay. That's fair. I'm going to come down here. Take some of you. How many times? 14, 15, 16 will do. Break down. <clears throat> now, one thing I didn't do yet was set up the configuration. So we want to turn that off. Uh, that will now be output. Auto output. And then turn this off. And this will be auto input. Okay. And the trusty old time in the bottle. <coughs> now we're going to speed this up as well. We've got plenty of time in here now. For over four and a half hours, which is good. I can not have to wait too long for processing. Notice how they're not really draining power that much anymore. Which I definitely enjoy. Okay, they're done. And that's done. And I got 19 gold out of that. And one copper. Alright, let's get back up here. Uh, so I needed glass. And I needed glowstone, of which I got some from the uh, Never. Pretty sure that's in my drawers. So uh, glass. I'll do for that for now. Glowstone is here. That will be enough. And then we're going to make some of these. Good. We can make six. That will do for me for now. I'm going to uh, double click that. And that will put the glowstone back. I do love storage drawers. Or functional storage, as it's now called. They can go back in there. That can go into there for what it's worth. Okay. So why? Why am I making these feral flare lanterns? So the reason being is that these light up a huge area over time and I will no longer need torches. Keeps everything a bit cleaner. So I can break all these down. Okay. Okay, so what you're going to see is that it's not actually 
particularly well lit up at the moment. But that's because it hasn't had time to spread its light. So I'm just going to do a bit of a hacky thing here. And this should speed up. You should see all this disappear. There you go. Look, slowly going. Right, this area is already gone. And this area is almost gone. Come on, do that corner. But it's filling a huge space around it with light, basically. So um, we're going to put them up. this and the final room which I haven't even used for anything yet three four and stick him in the middle perfect same here and same here now I am going to probably want a few more so if I make three I get six of them and I'm going to need two more, uh, five more glass. So, three of them. And then I need some sand. Okay, no sand. So, what I'll do is, um, for the cheaty way, uh, I got gold, I got glowstone, it was just the glass. So, you can pulverize gravel in sand. And I'm going to get back on the top. And what we'll do is have a bunch of glass. There we go. See, that's too much for the uh, power system to keep up with right now. But when we upgrade the cables, they'll be able to carry more power. And we should be okay from there. There goes all that. There goes all that. I'm just going to do this down here, seeming as we have... Okay, so I've got four of these now. Um, now, one thing we're going to need to do is this ceiling is very high. So we're going to have to um, do a thing. That's about the middle. Probably far enough away. Okay, one, two. Uh, probably two. I expect will be enough. I'm going to stick one there. This is just temporary. I will get rid of these pillars at some point. Very soon, actually, because I'm going to be um, doing a thing today. Or starting a thing today, at least. Alright, and we're going to go up here, I think. Go one, two. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Wanted it there. Yep. All right, and let that do its thing. Um, I've put this in the entirely wrong place because uh, trying to move too quick. So let's do this again. One, two, three. We'll take that, that, and that. I'm going to go over to this side here. There we go. I'm kind of thinking roughly about here. Two and light. <clears throat> and I think that's going to be enough, but I'm not going to break the torches yet until I've given them a chance to um, do their thing. So yeah. That's good. That is the first thing off my list, so I'm going to get rid of you. Now, next on my list is going to be some sort of flight. So I'm going to do a thing here. Um, yeah, I kind of figured that would be the case. So we're going to have to fix this. All right. I'm going to go like that. And if you shift, you can't fall off the edge. And I can sort of 
going like this. And then what we're going to do here is make a water source block so we can pump water. Because um, these jetpacks from Mechanism use hydro hydrogen to power it, hydrogen fuel. Um, and the way we get hydrogen in my modern Minecraft, at least, is, um, well, you can only get it in modern Minecraft, but in this pack is we have to split water into oxygen and hydrogen. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go back upstairs where all our materials are. I'm going to look at these recipes. So the first thing I need is something to gather water. It means I need that. I need four, five iron, four copper, a couple of glass. Let's see what we got. Uh, that one. Well, we've got some copper, we've got plenty of iron, we've got glass. I just need a bit of redstone. Nice. All right, uh, let's take a few a year. All right, let's try and do this to see if we got all the things. We need one of them. Ugh. We need one of them. And then we should be good. Yes, we got an aqueous accumulator. Good. All right. Um, just gonna stack all my crafting stuff over here. Uh, I don't need this right now. All right, get my other bucket out of here. My backpack out of the way. I need some water. Um, it would be best to get this from Sugar Cane Farm, which is also a. I kind of want a door here. I think. Yeah, I will put a door there if I can find one that I've already got. Might need to make a few more. We will see. Uh, door? Oh, I've got a door. Have I got a pressure plate? No. Okay. So I'm just going to um, get this done quickly. So we've got a couple for the future. All right, and then I'm going to put my uh, oak door and then pressure plate. Okay, perfect. All right. Um, yep. So we've got Iquis accumulator. Oh, where did you come from? Dot pyre. Yeah, you're dead, mate. Where the hell did it, I swear it's these little gaps up here. I'm going to have to fix this in a minute. Because I don't think there's any dark spots in here. Okay, anyway. Okay, we're doing okay with the uh, light situation now, I think. We're getting there anyway with these lanterns. there over there we will see we will see remember i haven't sped these ones up yet to fill the light so um we're gonna do that in a second in fact we're gonna do that right now Yeah, it does the same, and you can see the lights slowly appearing as it continues to fill the area. But that's good, that's good. No more torches. All right, um, yeah, aqueous accumulator is gonna go in the middle, so that's fine. So we need one in each corner, so I need three more buckets. Do I make two more? Yes, because I'm that voice for. All right. Oh, here another trader. Oh no, pillagers! Ooh, ho, ho, ho. Ooh, ho, ho. these guys are a holes. Okay, 
You wanna die? Perfect. And another ominous banner. All right, pillagers, thanks very much for your visit. You were not invited. Uh, yeah, water. Okay, back down here, back up to the corner. All right, I want one there. And this corner. Um. Oh, well, it filled itself in. Okay, I only needed two. Me and Minecraft vanilla mechanics are not that great. Aqueous accumulator lives in the middle there. Surrounded it, make sure you get the most out of it and everything. Um, okay, uh, next on my list is going to be the electrolytic separator. So this is the thing that um, I was talking about that... Um, Splits the water into oxygen or hydrogen. So we're going to need this, but we're going to need some dust. Two osmium, one iron, one gold. Uh, jump. Uh, osmium, osmium. Valet. Yep. I've got an iron. And I don't have a gold. I think I had one left over here, didn't I? Would be perfect. Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, what else did we need? So we need a couple of them. Redstone, let's say. Uh, five. So I need seven of those enriched allies through the um, metallurgic infuser over here. That's good. So seven redstone and seven of those. We'll let that get started. All right. Um, now I need to turn off the auto output and the auto input. Flint. Fine. Oh, God. Yeah, slow. Okay, that was more than we needed, but hey. One of you. Uh, I think I need to convert that. Yes. Yes. And then you go in there too. And that probably needs to be converted too. Okay. Um, let that hurry up. And then we should be mostly done with this. Yeah. All right. So let's uh, give this a go. Gonna craft this first. And then we should have. Oh, I'm missing one redstone. Of course I am. We'll take half a stack of them anyway, just to uh, keep us going. Uh, you and you. Okay, perfect. My inventory is starting to get into a mess. We don't really need flint right now. Don't really need another ominous banner. Oh my god, all these torches we're gonna have to get rid of. I'm going to empty that bucket of water because I really don't need it. All right. And then we're going to open our backpack and put some of this stuff away. Uh, torches for sure. Can put a pressure plate in there. You never know when that's going to come in handy. Okay. Um, so in here, I've got a bunch of cables that I knocked up. Some in between episodes. And what I'm going to do is, is I'm just going to um, break all this off again because behind here is my cable run. Yeah, no, that's not what I wanted to do. And these things take a little while to break, which is annoying. I'm just trying to be neat and tidy and not have exposed cables. Oh my god, that's annoying. All right.
Uh, yeah. Not being very smart about this. Let's just build our way back up there, shall we? Okay. And then that one, and this one so I can get in. <clears throat> All that because I don't want to lose a single cable because I'm that tight. All right. <clears throat> and then I want to dig back here a bit. Okay. And now we can have tidy cable. And then we come out here. And then that's perfect. All right. And then we can fill all this back in so we don't have to, to see the messy cable runs. All right. And we can put our electrolytic separator here. We've got power. And the one thing it needs now is a water. So let's go and clean up our inventory and um, get the stuff we need for our pipes. Uh, let's double click that. That gets rid of that. I uh, want that. want that. You can live in there. Uh, and then this stuff can go away. Alright. So you, you, you. Uh, glass doesn't live in there. Glass lives in there. Alright, that's good. Um, so I didn't put this into my... Stuff to make thing. So, um... Ah, pipes... And we want fluid pipe, which is a whole bunch of iron, and we get a use for it. two of those buckets, which is good. Uh, let's have that iron back. So how many do we need exactly? Three, six, and a singular redstone. Easy peasy. All right. Um, and then we're good. Because there's 16 of them. I need my pipe wrench. There. All right, back down to the basement. Moving fast here today. Let me just shift click that. Across here. Go across there. And then what we need to do is um, set this as an extract. And we should see. Oh, yep, yeah, you can hear it going now. Okay, so we want hydrogen, but we don't want oxygen right now. So what I'm going to do is set this to dump excess of oxygen so that it will keep running even when it fills up with hydrogen. You can see the water pouring in nicely now. And we're building up hydrogen here, which is exactly what I wanted. Now, we can use the oxygen a bit later um, if we want to get into more efficient um, ore processing. So getting like... Instead of getting th uh, four ingots for every three, we can start bumping that up to start getting two to one and then three to one and so on. Um, but it gets very compli complicated very quickly. But like this thing, because I've surrounded it with water and stuff, this is never going to get overwhelmed. That's filling up nicely. We're not running low on power. All right, next up is the jetpack. All right. So I need a couple of steel ingots for this, and that's totally fine. We need a basic chemical tank. Okay. And there we go. We see it's full of hydrogen now. That's good. So back up top. All right. Probably going to need a few um, osmium. So we'll... Uh, have a look at this again just make sure that i need uh that's the armored one so tin tin and steel all right let's see yeah we got tin ingots that's good gonna need a bit of redstone i'm gonna need four coal if you remember it's two coal per steel so back down here and this is the pretty simple bit. So what we're going to do... Uh, no, not that machine. That machine. Two of these. Four of these. Tie them in a bottle. 
and then put it back through again. We get steel dust. Let me put that in there. There's our two steel ingots. Perfect, and I'm just gonna dump my osmium in here. Uh, we want auto output, auto input. Okay, we got some osmium. That's perfect. Uh, and then I want one of these things. So that's one osmium, but two redstone. Moving through this quickly. Uh, you. Okay, let's go make this thing. Uh, so first we want the, yeah, we got that. Sorry, we don't want that. We want the chemical tank. And then we should be able to make this now. Yes. Now what we want, this takes the place of the uh, chest plate. So you're going to lose a lot of armor unless you make it into this armored jetpack, which means, okay, we need bronze. And we need some diamond dust and we need a block of steel. So that's nine steel ingots. And we've only got six iron, so we're going to need some more iron, which I haven't got much of. I'm going to need to go mining in between episodes. Uh, we didn't want eight. Yes, that's right. So six will give us like eight, I believe, on average. All right, so we want that. We want a couple of diamonds. Two of them. Uh, we can get rid of that. And then we want some bronze, so we need copper and tin. I haven't got any copper on me. Did we have any more? Yeah. Three copper, that means I need one tin. That's perfect. We'll get our bronze ingots. So bronze is uh, three copper ingots to one tin ingot. And you get um, four bronze ingots, I believe. Yep, that's all we need for this. Okay, so let's get this done. All right. So first up, we're going to put our um, iron through here because we need to get that done. Hey, dude. Um, yeah, I need you to speed up as well. Okay, we got enough iron for the block. Anyway, um, I need 18 coal. That's the one thing I forgot. I haven't quite got enough. Uh, well, that sucks. But um, one thing I do know, there was some coal pretty close to the surface down here. So I'm going to do that quickly. Um, let me get my mining laser. Wasn't planning to be doing this. In, oh, I didn't mean to place it. All right. So that's that. And then we're going to bust this and pick it back up again. Now, I saw some coal down here, not too far, if I remember rightly. Yeah, there it is. We didn't need much, so. Hooray for mining laser. And I'm just going to use the... Home command, because I'd get home quite easily anyway, and like, it's not a big deal. Okay, we definitely got enough coal now. So, back down to the basement. All right, so we got the iron. So we need nine, uh, induction smelter, we wanted three and one. And that's gonna get us our um, bronze. All right, in here we want nine of these and 18 coal we're gonna speed that right up we look at this we got our four four bronze and now we need our diamond dust so we're gonna turn auto output off to auto input off put them in there speed it up that's done so we're just gonna Oh yeah, that's enriched iron, that's not steel yet. Need to go through again. There's our two diamond dust. 
waiting on these now. <coughs> eight, seven, eight, nine, into the redstone furnace. Perfect. And then we're going to make that into our steel block. And then we should be able to have <coughs> an armor jetpack. And we can get rid of this gold thing. So if I do that, yep, I got full armor now. But I still can't fly. And that is because it has no hydrogen yet. So what I'm going to go do is come over to the electrolytic separator. Stick that in there. It's going to uh, fill up with a little bit of hydrogen. Although it takes 10 full tanks to fill this thing. It does make hydrogen constantly. As you can see here. But what I'm going to do is just to give you a demonstration. I've got it on my back. I just hold the jump button. And I now have some level of flight. E so let's just give you a view of that. And you get the particle effects. Oh, that actually goes outside. So that's why I'm having them problems. Okay. So whilst I'm here, before I just end the episode, I'm just going to use my newfound flight and um, fix this issue with stuff coming in. Is there any more? No, I think we're done. Okay, cool. Well, that is it for episode eight. We got that achieved today. So today we did the um, mechanism jetpack, which is kind of OP for any game, but I'm totally cool with that. Um, and we also did the um, electrolytic separator thing over there, which gives us a supply of hydrogen and oxygen. So that's it for this episode. Good. Thank you all for watching. Good to see you all. I can't see you. I don't know what I'm talking about, but we're going to end it there for today. See you next time.